Okay, sorry. Okay, now this is our uh, our talk, of course, a weekly talk, and I want to hear two figures in history who were um, bad guys. So, Jonathan, I want you to give me a couple of bad guys who you think were bad and why they were bad. Uh, Jack the Ripper and um, Hitler. Jack the Ripper and Adolf Hitler? Yeah. Okay. Why Jack the Ripper and why Adolf Hitler? Because they couldn't just, they couldn't just, um, they couldn't just kill people like, you know, uh, regular psychopaths. They had to, uh, go all out their way to, um, torture them and rip them apart and mangle them. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so you just gather, you put them both together like that. You couldn't give me nothing special about, um, Jack the Ripper individually or... Um, he used to rip his victims apart. His bare hands? Um, I don't recall exactly, but, um, I don't recall exactly whether he always used something or not, what he did, used to do that. Yep. Yeah, I think he used, um, doctor's tools to operate on his, uh, victims and he would um, open them up. I'm sure there was some pooling and uh, sort of zombie type this about his um, dastly deeds but uh, I think mostly he used tools, doctors too so they thought he was a, a doctor because he, he was um, very um, skillful in his way of um, doing what he did. Okay, now Adolf Hitler. Now, why you say he was a bad guy? Because he was, he was torturing people. And he brainwashed so many people. Like, I mean, he was practically like a religion. It, even, even you know, even as like a symbol of authority. You know, he worked his way up there. And then everybody just like, just like was brainwashed to his, to his power. Like, he, even his own people. Some of the, I used to watch some of the documentaries and stuff, like how, how if anybody was clapping during their meetings, they were just killed or something like that. It was just like real strict, a super brainwash. You sure you're not mixing Adolf Hitler up with the people from North uh, Korea? <laughs> I'm not sure, but I haven't watched too many North Koreans, so I think, I think it's Adolf. Okay. Well, I don't recall ever hearing that Adolf Hitler uh, killed people for clapping. I think Adolf Hitler loved clapping. No, he said people, he, he only killed people that didn't clap. It was like whatever, it, I don't know whether it was clapping or didn't clap. Whatever, what I'm saying is whatever they were doing at the time, they were clapping, standing, sitting, you know, walking, not walking. It was like... Everybody should be doing it. <laughs> <laughs> and if they're not, <laughs> it's... <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. All right, Prince. What's your... Um, I have absolutely not... I cannot... You can't name two given bad guys in history. Um, let's see. Maybe... Okay, just give us a couple of them. I thought you mentioned one earlier, but uh, I was going to ask you what. Uh, Vlad the Impaler. What's his name again? Vlad the Impaler. Oh, okay. So, why is he so bad? Well, first off, the way he killed his people was so gruesome that the whole the whole plan of like the way he actually murdered everyone was just to scare other people away once they came out and saw their own people all, toward, all like hung up and like tortured outside outside of his um outside of his town 
so that like if anyone tried to invade, they would just blow, fear like fear him and run away. Oh, okay, it, okay. And his name was uh, Glad the the Impel. The impeller, because I guess he impaled people. Okay. Um, so, give me another person and why. Dada. I'm a bad guy. Oh, okay. Yeah, you can include me. Now, why would you uh, uh, put me up there with Glad the Impeller? I mean, I'm honored that you would put me with... <laughs> well... <laughs> that... That you would put me up there with Hitler, Glad the Impeller, uh, Jack the Ripper, and Dada. <laughs> uh, 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 you're a brave man staying in the same house with me. Because <laughs> I'm a bad man. <laughs> Instead of, uh, he called, he called that person over time. My name is Vinny. <laughs> 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 no, I think this hole you dug yourself, you're going to have to, uh, uh <laughs> fill it in. <laughs> John said, he can't, he can't help you with this one. My name is Vinny, and I ain't in it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm up there with Glad the Impeller. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let me know uh, why Dada is up there with Glass the Impeller. Uh, because he told you to stop doing something. Uh, <laughs> Stopped you from watching, playing a game, huh? That's was, up there. Like, That's pretty bad, though. Yeah, that was a playing game. Oh, you were kidding. Oh, okay. I wasn't playing. No, you wasn't playing. Okay, I didn't think you were playing, but I just wanted to know why. You had to give us a bad guy and then give us why uh, that person is bad. Too many things to count. Too many things, okay. So, can you name a, a, maybe another bad guy that you can mention some stuff he does? Because um, we actually are trying to get a conclusion in this. Uh, I can't think about it now. You can only think of Glad the Impaler and me. Yep. There's too many right now. I can't think of two. Oh, okay. Well, I guess you gave it a lot of thought. I can see you really going places in life. Just want you know, you go far. I think, I think you really gonna make your mark in life. All right. It's bad I can't choose people that are terrible. I'm sorry. What'd you say? It's too bad you can't choose people who are terrible. Yeah. You can. That's what we were talking about. I, I thought. Huh? I can't think of one right now. Okay. Just that one. Glad and uh, Dad. Yep. <laughs> it's Glad, by the way. Glad, like Glad. Glad. Oh, okay. All right. So, now, um, I need to ask you guys this. What do you guys think would make... Or who do you think would make a super man? If you had to put ingredients in a bottle, what ingredients would you put in a man to make him a superman? Not a superman like, okay, the ability to fly and the, to, to stop bullets. I'm not talking about that kind of superman. I'm talking about like a super man, a real man. What would... Um, what would you put, if it was possible, to put it in a um, chemical formula for him to drink like a man shake? Uh, that he would become that shake. What ingredients would you put in him? Start with you, Johnson, since... Uh, To, to, um, to learn anything instantly. <laughs> just figure it out. Just boom. Just know it. 
<laughs> inside, out, upside down. But now we're not talking about Superman now. We're not talking about, you know, like breathing underwater and, oh, yeah. you know, memorizing the whole book in five minutes. I'm not talking like that. I'm talking about a man, a real man. Or what do you consider a man to be that would make him a good father, a good husband, a good role model? What just, what things would you put in there? Just be, just be him. Just be yourself. Just whatever he does or whatever he's good at, whatever it is, whether it be picking lint up off the floor or being an astrophysicist, just 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 do it to his heart content, live his passion, you know, and um and you know and and show love and support and you know, just be him, live live that's that you know and as long as you know he's not you know doing anything to hurt anybody else nobody should ask anything else from him okay that's part of the ingredients that you would put into the man shake yeah. okay uh prince uh i like i like to do is just be with Jed. yes can you add um a couple of things that you think would make a man um, a better human being, a better, you know. Okay, so you said one of the things you said was compassionate. Then what else is there? Be yourself and be okay. So. El Capone, well, he was being himself. Maybe Vlad the Impeller was being himself. Just don't yeah. kill people. <laughs> okay. oh, I guess that's all. I, I guess, you know, that might, you know, might feel kind of bad about saying, ah, oh, that's my pops, you know, yeah, he slaughtered a couple folks. But <laughs> he's still a great guy, though. <laughs> 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 I feel a little embarrassed about that. <laughs> but, I mean, he's still, like, he, he would still be, like, being who he is, though, you know? Even if it is psycho, you know, if, if he's crazy, you know, pops a little out the, out the frame. No, but I, I really want to, I want to wrap this up, to wrap this meeting up, but I, I'd like to know what, um, and I like the answers that you gave earlier, and uh, Prince, uh, I want you to um, okay. add something to the pot that is uh, constructive. What, um... What do you think helps mold a man, and what do you think a man, what makes a man uh, unique or special? I can't see you and I can't hear you. Well, if you, uh, besides being compassionate, being respectful. Oh, respectful. Yeah, that's one of the ones you think? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's an interesting choice. Huh? If I can see your mouth when you mom your words, that would help. People need you, and knowing when you've crossed your line. Oh, okay. I, I want to say this. I think I think every everybody should have this. Not just guys, girls. Everybody should have this. Is is progress? You know, just just you know, just you know, just constantly, constantly just advancing. You know, just just. Yeah, and that's, that's like, you know, I think that's like the biggest thing, you know, constantly advancing, just whatever it is, just constantly, just, oh, yo, Pops, he did this today, he's doing that tomorrow, you know, he did that tomorrow, he's doing, you know, it's just always something new, it's always progress, you know, that's, that's it. Okay, sounds good, sounds like a good note to end it on. You got anything to add to that, Prince? Nope. I didn't hear you. What'd you say? Nope. Okay. Well, we talked about bad guys. And we talked about good guys. We talked about bad men. We talked about good men. And um, I want to ask this last question. What kind of man do you want to be, Pope? When you grow up, 
finish growing. A good one that knows how to respect people and knows his own boundaries, and a one that is very smart and strong. I'm sorry, what did you say? A man that knows his boundaries, knows how to respect people, and knows in being smart and strong. But that last part was smart and strong, you said before? Yes. Okay. And when you say strong, you mean physically strong or mental strong? Both. Yes, I mean by smart and strong. Okay. What kind of guy do you, uh, man, do you, uh, wish to, um, what do you want to be like when you, uh, job? I want to be a, um, let me see. Um, um I want to be a, a you know, I want to be successful, you know, be successful. I want to, um, I be an entrepreneur, have a family. I want to be a good father to my kids. Um, I want to, um, um, I want to live out my dreams. You know, whatever they are. Yeah. Oh, I just want to live them out. And that's it. That's it. Yeah. Okay. Follow your dreams. Want to be a good father, good parent. Sounds good. Any um, thing else you want to add to that, Prince? Absolutely nothing. What do you think of what Jonathan said? I think it was a well, distro a well good decision choice. Since. Okay. Jonathan, what do you think about what Prince said? Um, I thought it was good. Okay, you guys pretty much kept it simple. Thank you guys for your time. Next week, same time, same place. Okay, let's put the hands in. Lord, we thank you for this time we had together. We thank you for your mercy. We ask you have mercy upon our souls. Forgive us of our sins. Remember our loved ones everywhere. Bless the people around us. Keep us safe and sound. Until next time. In Jesus' name. Alright. Thank you, gentlemen. God.